this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to uh, install Oracle's Virtual Box. A Virtual Box is an application uh, that virtualizes machines, uh, operating machines like Windows, Unix, and Linux, and all its distros that are associated with it. So I'm going to start by downloading the software first, and then I'm going to install it after that. So go and open up the browser. Type in VirtualBox in the search. I click on this link because this is where we want to go. VirtualBox.org. Download. And I'm running a Windows 10 machine, so I'm going to install, uh, download the one for that. And there are other as as well. For example, OS X, Mac, and for Linux and Unix, also as well. So I'm going to click on for the Windows host. And that's going to take about a minute. So I'm going to wait until this finishes and then I'm going to come back. Okay, it's finished downloading and I'm going to now run and install VirtualBox on Windows 10 now. So that, the browser window, and click on run. There's the welcome screen and click next. Check what it's going to install. It's going to install the application and busy support and a VirtualBox networking Ethernet adapter. Uh, there are two. There's a only there's a bridge networking adapter and a host only networking adapter. And yes, we do want that. And it's going to install uh, VirtualBox in this location, Programs folder. Click on Next. And yes, I want to create the Start Menu Entries. Uh, by that, what it means going to show up here uh, on start menu Windows start menu and create a shortcut on the desktop yes I do want a shortcut for this on the desktop uh, create a shortcut in the quick launch bar no I don't think I need that so I'm going to leave that off and register all file associations uh, for the virtual box to the application of virtual box yes I do want that click on next it says warning is going to install the VM uh, virtual bus networking feature, which will include the networking adapter for it. It may disconnect um, your net, our, our own network, but that's okay. We need to do that. Proceed installation. Yes, click on yes. And then, it's, and then install. Uh, you might not see this, but I'm getting a permissions uh, dialog box. It needs to install, it needs administrative permissions, install the software. I'm going to click on yes. And untick this for now, and I'm going to click finish. And install, uh, it's finished installing VirtualBox. Okay, so it looks like we're going to open this up. Now you'll see that uh, there are already three uh, virtual machines uh, listed. Uh, these are virtual machines that I created uh, in my last uh, installation. So it quickly picked that up. So, and that's the end of the tutorial. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to configure a uh, virtual box. And if you like this video, click, don't forget to click like and uh, subscribe to the channel.